Hey guys and gals, I'm Pal, and welcome back to The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. When we last left off, we were stranded on an island. And that island removed all of our gear from us and told us to survive. And I, I think by seeing uh, me now, you can tell that I did. This episode, we're ultimately heading over to the, I, I assume, Elden region. Although it could be Faron, considering that the Laneru region was a water area, it could be Faron, I don't know. But I'm assuming it's Death Mountain, we're going to be heading towards there. But I saw this in the distance last episode, and I'm really curious about what it is. So I'm heading there now. I, at first I thought it was a Divine Beast, and now it looks like some sort of skull? Maybe? But it looks... Weird and incredibly out of place. There's also a shrine over there. Uh, there's so many things to do. But I decided to at least check this thing out. What is this? It's a. It's a. A fortress? Maybe? Oh, I forgot they can swim. Hell oh boy, we have a fight on our hands. Here, let's equip a different bow. Uh, Traveler's Bow. No, I'm not about that. You. Kindly. Leave me. Alone. Man, this bow's powerful. And he's done. What is this about? It's just, it's so out of place. Let's grab all this stuff with a Boko shield. Cool. Don't, don't kill me, bro. What is over here? Is there anything good? Oh, there's a chest! What does that chest have? And... Is there... There's nothing in the water. Man, this looks like there should be something here. Besides this skimpy chest, which probably just has arrows in it. No, a silver rupee. I mean, I guess that's okay, but... Really, I was expecting some giant fish or something. A mini-boss. Something. Throw me a bone. Alright, we're gonna go over and, and discover that shrine, and then we're gonna be heading over to the the thing I, I'm not going to be doing this shrine I'm going to be explore I'm going to be discovering it that's a little bit different just a little bit you know actually no I don't even need to do that let's just let's just mark it on our map there now we know it's there and now I can travel over to the stables I wish I had this kind of an artistic skill have you come to look at this picture too? It's so beautiful, I could spend hours just looking at it. This painting was made by Ozunda, the owner of the stable, or so I hear. That volcano in the background, it's so majestic, and the stable is subtle in the scenery. I think the stable is painted from a southern direction. The composition is just so impressive. What is... Are we supposed to get a picture of it? This, some of it looks familiar. Oh, there's a memory. Okay, let's... Here, let's look at this. From a southern perspective. Okay, we can go grab that. It's it's in our our agenda. It's still in a new area. So let's grab our... Let's grab our horse. And uh, go find that, shall we? So we're in a southern direction. I'm guessing right on that knoll over there. What was that heart? That was odd. Kind of creepy, you, you devil horse you. Is that Beetle? I think that's Beetle. Here, I'll check to see what Beetle's selling real quick. Here, Beetle. What do you say? What do you? What are you selling? Arrows. I'll actually take. I'll take. I'll take them all. Wow. I I could use. Yeah, I could use some arrows. There. That's it. Okay. So fr from a southern direction, eh? Also, I don't. I probably shouldn't be on heart. Uh, this. Is not quite the angle I'm looking for. Maybe up there? Oh, I see where this is taken from. It's taken from... All the way over this way. I was I was going completely the wrong direction. It's taken from the far left here. And the shrine that I'm detecting right now... Is in the photograph. I just need to jump down this way over, over here is about where it is. Okay, so there's the shrine. This is almost the framing I'm looking for. 
Almost. Wait, did I just... No, I didn't see it. Okay. Problem is, we can't see the shrine from here. Oh, wait. Ah, oh, man. It's... It's so weird, because I keep seeing things far away that look like they could... They match the description of the the painting, but they're not quite there. And I'm, I think I'm too far away from it now to accurately d get a depiction. So I think I'm way too far away, but I'll, I'll still pick up this shrine along the way, and then I'll get back to my, uh, my normal business. But I'll get back to my normal business, and then you guys can tell me where on earth I should be looking. Because I want to get all the memories. Mainly just because I'm interested in them. They're they're cool. It's nice seeing a snippet of what used to be, and it it tells the story where nothing else does. I mean, the only time we get snippets of the story are, I assume, the four divine beasts. And that's not really enough. I'm, I'm used to Skyward Sword where there's exposition all the time. And they're, they're constantly new story beats to, to adapt to. And this, it, there's just nothing. And... I kind of miss it sometimes, which is why I like the, uh, the memories so much. Okay, we'll go grab this shrine, and then we'll go about our normal business. This thing's right in the middle of nowhere, ain't it? It's just pocketed back here. This is the M Ta Mule Shrine. What? What? Oh, wait, what? Oh! We completed the quest! Okay, maybe there wasn't a memory, it was just... A shrine! Okay! Passing the flame. Ta Mul Shrine. What flame? This flame? We're supposed to pass it... By shooting the wall. That's what it is. Maybe? There's room here, so may I think I think that's it, yeah. We're passing the flame. Is that what we need to do though? And can we use this blue flame as well? Uh this is not flame. Okay, never mind. So we need do I have any fire arrows? I do not have any fire arrows, so I, I need to work with the flame that I am given. Oh, but there's another one here. Uh, How are we supposed to pass this flame? I get shooting it, but that's not going to get all of them here. I'll just work, work the ones that I can. Because that is indeed all I can do. There's another one. Those are not burning. That has not changed. There's no other flame anywhere. Here, I think I can get this one. Oh, oh, I can just light it. Oh. Cool. Okay. I can just light the thing. Neat. Well, that, that makes things a lot easier. Uh, let's equip a trash bow while I'm at it. Light the arrow. There's a chest here. Which that will do nothing against. Oh, but that will. Neat. They just burn that up. And it burnt up the chest too. And we got an opal. And are we done? I mean, that'll burn down the thing we need to get through here. That's... that went right through, didn't it? That's... Oh! There it stars above. Ace Ventura strikes again, and there's this locked thing. So we can get there right now, but they're giving us options to... Br ha, they're giving us options to branch out! I can just cut this? Apparently. Then why do I need fire? Because I could just cut the gobble crusher. Whoa. What am I dropping for this? Uh, because I should probably drop something. 
Gobble Crusher? Should I just draw my... Oh, I have a Quark Leaf. Never mind. I was gonna say, I should drop the Boomerang. In fact, I should just equip the Boomerang. This thing... I got this thing forever ago. I need to start using it. Gobble Crusher. Cool. I have the stamina to make that work. Okay, so there's a key that we need to get. Now, how are we going to get that key? We can get the our reward right now. But we shouldn't. Is there something I can... Oh! Wait a minute. That's how we get it. Get the key through the grate. Or above it? Above it. Get our small key. And get another cool thing. Whatever that thing is. The ruby! Nice! I'll take that. There's some good songs in that series. Alright, let's get a reward and leave. On the road again. I accidentally just lo threw my boomerang off a cliff, so, uh... It's gone. <laughs> I was just trying to feed a Poe, and... I threw it, and it's dead forever. What is that? What? I what is that? A weird crystal? I will not take... What is that? Nothing. Okay, it's just a lamp. Well, okay. I tried. So, we're riding into a new area for the first time. Ultimately trying to get to that tower. Not only does it seem to be one of the highest places in the region, but it's also important that we get those towers. There's a sign. What does that sign say and or do? Death Mountain Marker Number 1. Climbing Path Trailhead. Well, thankfully I do have my climbing gear. Why did I do that? I do have my climbing gear. So I should be outfitted for this. Just a bunch of steam. A traveler, which... You know what? I'm not going to talk to the traveler. They all say the same thing. They all talk about their, their woes. They talk about stress they had at work. And I don't need that in my life. That's boring. So, am I taking a right or a left? I'm taking a left, actually. Eh, you, you don't need help. You don't need help, buddy. Is this a wise choice in direction? I'm feeling like it's not. There's some luminous stones up there. But ultimately, I don't think this is a path designed for Hart. And so, Hart and I are going the other way, then. There's another tower up there. That's kind of odd. They're in fairly close proximity. Oh, Hart, buddy. Come on, you, you, you got this. You got this. Thank you. Hart, buddy. Come on. You've done this before. There's a guardian. As far out as this, we are still seeing guardians. And I'm gonna burn for that one. Oh! Oh! oh. Live guardian. Bad. Bad live guardian. I do not feel fit to defeat a guardian right now. There are actually some... Oh boy! No, 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 no. Oh, that's not good either. That's not good either. That is not good either. Uh, this does attack boost. Uh, that's probably the most innocent I think I have, but I don't need to heal that much. Let's just eat a couple of these. Um, um, what do I do? I've faced one of these things before. But I don't want to face it now. Here, first, first, first. We are going to equip stealth gear. In case I manage to get away from this thing. Oh, that hit me actually. And then we're going to jump off this. Oh, oh boy. Heart, you're fine. You're fine, buddy. Is Heart okay? I just want to know that Heart's folk okay. Do not kill Heart, please. He and I have gotten very close over the over this time. It's thinking. I'm not sure what it's thinking though. There's a shrine over here, apparently.
And it fell asleep. Can I call Heart from here? Yes, yes, good boy, Heart. They don't care about the horse. Yes. Okay, I'm heading towards a shrine somewhere. Somewhere down in this water, actually. Where is it? I'm heading in the right way. A bunch of birds over there. I think it's across the way, so I won't bother with it. Yeah, I know Heart can't come. I still ultimately want to head up towards that tower, but with the Guardian in the way, it's not looking very likely. Don't see me. Thank you. Okay, we're just going to ride around him. Stop at this Guardian to pick up some, some stuff. A rusty shield and an arrow. It looks like this guy was actually successful in killing a Guardian. Shot it right in the eye. I need to keep that in mind for later. Because while, while I do think that I could defeat a Guardian, I don't want to. They're kind of scary still. I wouldn't want to cross path, paths with one. And so for now, I'm just going to leave it be. And, and move on. And move on with my life. What is that? Just a flag or something? Just a flag, I guess. So we're heading up the mountain, away from the tower, but ultimately towards something. The game is leading us in a direction. Hmm. I wonder... It's probably leading us towards a cutscene. I, I assume that the game is going to start following a formula of... Oh, you're exploring an area. I'm not getting too hot, am I? No, I'm not. Oh, you're exploring an area. Oh, there's there's the new sage or, or whatever. Uh, bombs... Okay, what's in here? Just that? Really? I do not want to use my flame blade on that. There. Got some amber. Not bad. And some fire key swings. Uh, I'm actually a bit worried from here on out because of how hot I'm getting. I'm getting pretty hot here. And I don't want... I, I have a feeling that I'm going to have to start taking some sort of of food to not be too hot. If there's ever an area where you would get too hot, an area filled with lava would probably be it. And we're actually heading now towards the tower, which is which is nice. The game's leading me towards where I wanted to go. We're very close there. Kill him. There. That is the first time, actually, I've used a sword on horseback. And it felt completely natural. Uh, Well, this is where it looks like heart is is going to stay. I don't I don't think I can take you on that, buddy. I don't think you can climb that well. Let's equip our gear. Very handily color-coded. Hey, Link, can you climb the ash? You can climb the ash. All right. Whew, we're we're making some headway here. I assume that they're not going to get make us too hot before we reach the tower. Or they might. Oh, yes, they did. Uh, well, question answered. Let's just not be uh, around the lava. Also, that's very realistic. In real life, if there's lava near you, you can't actually get close to it without getting burnt. Uh, literally, when if you were to fall into lava, that's impossible. Because by the time you get close to the lava... Oh, hello. By the time you get close to the lava... All of the, the liquid in your body actually comes to a boil, and you end up... You end up exploding. Okay. Oh! Yeah, well, I'm fine. Oh, I'm fine. Whew! I think I can climb up from this. I think I have good climbing gear. Hopefully this guy will not... He will not try anything, anything frisky. We have seen flying guardians, so we know it's possible, but I don't think that the ones that aren't flying now can fly. Uh, I need to head towards that ledge. This is getting kind of worrisome. I might have to drop off and fly over there? Actually, no, I think that, yeah, I can stand on this ledge. 
No. Oh, that did not go as planned. But it worked. It worked. Okay, straight up from here, and then we can reach the top of the tower and maybe end the episode? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Whew. This is this is getting weird. It's it all is actually getting a little bit weird playing this series while uh, Pikmin is is ending. Pikmin lasted a little bit longer than I expected it to, uh, and is quickly reaching the 40 episode mark. And it's going to exceed that for the main series, and then for the co-op series, it's probably going to go up to episode f to the late 50s or maybe early 60s. And this series is still going strong with no end in sight. Uh, here. I don't have this gear equipped, but now I do. I have the Phrenic Bow equipped, which is my favorite weapon. Let's shoot this guy. Oh, dude, that's so cool. All of my arrows, because it's in, in the heat, all of my arrows are infused with fire, so they just instantly catch fire. Flames! Flames! Yeah. No! That was close. That was close. That was incredibly close. Okay. Uh, so there's fire there. I am going to run up, grab the chest, and then leave. I think that's wise, because while I can sneak and maybe kill him that way, there's also a bunch of fire. So I don't want to kill myself with the fire. What is his weapon, also? Yeah, it's just a- it's a Fort Lizelle Boomerang. So let's run in there, grab this, heal myself along the way, grab this, while I'm on fire, shock, five shock arrows, I haven't seen those in a while, uh, all my weapons are on fire, what? Wait a minute. Oh, wooden shields and stuff catch fire. Wood and shields and stuff catch fire. Let's equip. That's why they're smoking. Uh, let's equip this. We're equipping that. We're fine. Okay. And then run. Are all the weapons in my inventory going to catch flame? No, I think they're fine. I'm just going to need to heal myself. Am I still on fire? No, I'm fine now. Okay. Elden Tower. This is the Elden region. Nice. I was kind of worried that they would pull some weird... Garbage where they said no, this is the Farron region. I mean they did that with Lineru, although that did have some ocean elements in it already, so Okay, use my super sweet climbing gear. I'm really liking that. I'm I'm color-coding them. Oh, but what I was saying with Pikmin uh, that series is Not only quickly becoming my favorite series of all time, but uh, it's it's got on average four times It's my most viewed series of all time first of all uh, already, and it has gotten four times the views of, on average, of this series, which is crazy to me, because this is, you know, this is a new game. This is brand new. It's the the future, and this is getting less views than a game that is 15, almost 20 years old, which I'm kind of proud of. I made Pikmin more popular than Breath of the Wild, at least on this channel, but it's, it's still kind of weird coping with that, because I was expecting... That's the whole reason why my, my channel isn't currently outlaid with Breath of the Wild art, because originally I was of the, uh, the persuasion that I would need to give Pikmin 2 more advertisement because everyone would be flocking to see Breath of the Wild, but no, Breath of the Wild is the one that needs help, which I'm kind of happy about. That's kind of cool that Pikmin is getting so popular on my channel. But that doesn't mean I'm I'm not enjoying this series. It's it's partially for me, partially for you guys. I I really like playing Zelda, and playing Breath of the Wild is a good way for me to experience Zelda. And we've discovered a new area, which is sweet. I forgot that there's a mountain, and so that design looked really odd to me. Man, I everywhere I look in this game, everywhere that mountain. What? Okay. But this mountain? Xenoblade. The... That pool of, of lava? That screams Xenoblade. That... Let's see. That over there? That that bridge? That's from Xenoblade. 
just everything in this game. I love it. It's from Xenoblade. I, I think I've talked about this like three times now, and each time I say, I'm not sure if I've talked about this before, but the, uh, the Monolith Soft, the same people who made Xenoblade and Xenoblade Chronicles X, uh, they are in charge of making all of the terrain in Breath of the Wild, which is why, however many times I've said, this looks like it's from Xenoblade. It's because it is, actually. I mean, it's not ported, but it's the same developers. It's the same brand. There's, They have a, a very nice artistic style with that. And so it's it's just great to see Xenoblade in so many different things. Here, uh, let's just grab this. Oh, come on. Slap him! Slap him! Yeah! I might be able to even push him off the mountain. Hoi! Hoi! Yeah! And he's done? Maybe? Oh, come on. Yeah! This is working really well. Except for this part where it's not. Oi! You know what? Let's just... Let's just kill him! Oh! Uh, in case it wasn't obvious, that's actually it for this episode. Uh, what am I gonna eat here? Uh, yeah, this works. That is actually it for this episode. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Mainly, this is the end of the episode. Not... Not just because we've run out of time. Uh, defense boost, I guess? Um, not just because we've run out of time, but... Because I need to go to... Mount Lanayru at this point, and I need to be making some some chill uh, potions. If you recall, I'm not sure if I showed it off on screen or not, but when we were in that area, we found a type of mushroom. In fact, I have a couple in my inventory here. Uh, right... There it is. The chill shroom, and that can make elixirs that keep us cool. So I think that we're, we actually need to... to, uh use those if we want to progress so if you enjoyed this episode in any capacity that was the one of the coolest things i've ever done oh boy look at him go look at him go down that hill that's he's still going and there he goes if you enjoyed this, enjoyed this episode in any capacity please click like if you didn't then drop a comment telling me i can make the next episode so that you would like it i release new episodes of the legend of zelda breath of the wild every there's a shrine up there i think every Monday and Wednesday, and I'll see you guys next time. Oh, and I'm also playing uh, Pikmin 2 right now, in case it wasn't obvious from what I just talked about. I'm also playing Pikmin 2, and that comes out every Tuesday and Thursday. All right, next time we're going to be heading somewhere, I suppose towards the mountain, with some uh, some potions being chugged. So, yeah, join us then. That's the wrong button. Uh, what is the button for... Okay, so I need to do... Yeah! Look at me go! No, you can slide. You can do this. You can do this, Link. Yeah, look at me go! Uh, here, let me... Let me try that again. Let's just eat this. Look at me go! Woohoo! Yeah! The major hang time error! Major hang time error, and I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Uh, let's just eat this. This thing. And my shield's broken. <laughs> uh, and there, there's death. There's a lot of death. What is happening? Where are those coming from? Okay, well, I guess you can join me then when we do that. And we'll have fun, and it'll be cool. And that boulder's floating. Alright, see you guys then. <gasps> oh, I know what they're doing. That's so dumb. What they're doing here is they're they're setting up... I knew it. I knew it. They're setting up for enemies dropping from the ceiling by scrambling my... I don't think I can tangle with this. I'll be honest. Oh. <laughs> I really don't think I can even touch this. Here, let's, let's find... Out? Here. 